If you've been told you have a bone bruise like Travis Kelsey or you hyperextended your knee, well, I'm Dr. P and you have a problem with your knee, talk to me. This is an x-ray of a knee and this is a knee model here and flexion is bending the knee. So when we bend the knee, that's one way. Hyperextending or extending it is going this direction. And a hyperextension usually happens when someone gets hit from the front in a sporting injury. The femur, the thigh bone bangs into the shin bone, the tibia. And on an x-ray, you don't often see that. Why is that? Because bone is hard on the surface, okay? This is real bone. Underneath the surface, if you peel that off, it's got little um, areas that kind of look like coral. So it's porous. And when those two bones bang into each other, you get little micro fractures. You can't see them on an x-ray, but you can see them on an MRI, which uses magnets to make a three-dimensional image. So on an MRI, the bone should be black. Now these are growth plates right here, but these white areas right here are areas where the bone has banged into itself and there's little micro fractures there, almost like stress fractures. So those are gonna take, like any stress fracture, those are gonna take about three to six weeks to heal. So you're usually not gonna be able to quote, play through it like I've been hearing. It's usually not gonna take one or two weeks, unless of course you're playing in the Super Bowl or something like that. I don't know exactly what his injury was and I don't know exactly what your injury was if you've been told that, but in general, that's what we see. We see a lot of these. And it's usually not going to be one or two weeks. It may be three to six weeks. So if you uh, have questions, um, give us a call or comment. And our phone number is 315-685-7544.